just one sec. You uh, know we gotta do that test. Okay, everything seems good and fine. Hello, everybody. My snakers. I literally just got up. But we're recording anyway. Okay. I guess we're just gonna sit here on the. Oh, never mind. Okay, wait, wait, wait. And we're good. Don't, don't do that to me. Come on. Come on. You know how hard it is to get a meeting with the magistrate? Don't keep oh. him waiting. I forgot. Okay, right back in the loading. That was actually that was pretty fast. Thank you so much for coming, Bounty Hunter. Our pleasure. Nice view you got up here. Look, I'll cut to the chase. I need your help. You're a human, correct? My men looked into it. Sorry. You survived the G3's attack on your home planet Earth, right? Yeah, they're a human. We're Kinda. Gatlin. Of course. Sorry. I'm familiar with your plight as well. It's such a tragedy what happened on Gatlas. It makes much sense that you and the human would join forces, but perhaps you have room for one more ally as well? <laughs> a lawless bounty hunter teaming up with a squeaky clean politician. <laughs> really? That's precisely why I need your help. I'm having the darndest time curbing the species drug trade. I can only do so much, and only within the confines of the law. I mean, I've got my hands full with Gary the Poisoner. He's not just poisoning the water supply, he's moved on to poisoning weirder stuff now. Is like this your ugly lamps. ass photo? We don't even know how that works, or if it's actually a problem. A Maybe it's fine head, to poison dude. street lamps. I'm a bit overwhelmed, and I wish I could focus more time on the G3. But you, you've taken out two top G3 officers in less time than it takes us to file a single report. So you That's see how you can help me. But there's also one way I can help you. Go on, let me take it all in. This tool on my desk here will help you rescue your fellow humans. You can use it to teleport them to a safe haven my team has arranged for them to stay at until the G3 are dealt with. Anything you gotta say about this, Twizy? What's the catch? Well, the human species is technically a drug. I can't have dangerous sentient drugs in the hands of my citizens, and you can't have your people getting captured and consumed. This solves both of our problems, assuming you plan to continue taking out the G3. Yeah, no shit, like we're gonna stop now. Then, thank you. Sincerely, you humans and Gatlians, you're both very noble species. This means a lot to me. I've made it my life's work to use my power to help people in need, but even I have my limits. I'm just glad I have someone like you to turn to. As a token of thanks, my team will be feeding any intel we find on the G3 directly to your handler, Mr. Zaruthian. We've already sent him everything we have. Oh? The rest is in your hands. Yeah, yeah, whatever. We just like killing freaks. If you want to help, you're more than welcome. That's all I have for you. Feel free to stay as long as you like. The view is breathtaking. All right, Nifey, this is the perfect time to backstab him. Oh, uh, feel free to stay as long as you'd like. What happens if we actually stay? You can visit the human haven yourself, by the way. We don't know exactly what makes humans comfortable, but I hope you like how we've set things up. Uh-huh. Continue.
I won't ask to see your face, but I okay, am bye. curious. I'll bet you're covered in cool. I don't know what he was about to say, but it probably wasn't anything good. saying they'll hook us up with any G... Yeah, not only that, he gave us a way to save humans. God damn. You got it easy. Nothing as convenient as this ever happened when I was bounty hunting. Hey, uh, speaking of, we should get you a jetpack before you head back out into the field. You're really gonna need it. Head on down to the pawn shop and see if they got one in stock. Oh, and yeah, you might want to hit up Broto's chef stand, too. It's a little shady, but uh, those warp discs he's selling can be pretty helpful. So this is your bedroom, huh? Yep. It's fine. I mean, I don't, I, don't, I don't really know what I was expecting, to be honest. I wonder. Is he gonna do it again? Hmm. Okay, then. One can live, okay? Not gonna lie, from like this far away, I thought the homeboy was the Grinch. Not where I guess ran first. Hey, you got any uh, jetpacks in stock? A jetpack? Oh, certainly. I can help. Uh, I can help. Is... Is this it? It's... Okay. Ah, jetpack, huh? Great choice. Really phenomenal choice. Let's lock that purchase in. Okay, great. So where where's the jetpack? Not so fast. I gotta back order that bad boy. I'll have it ready for you in a couple of days, I promise. No refunds, by the way. This purchase is final. Fuck! God damn it. Okay, well let's let's just give Scam. Gene the update. That's all mine because I'm broken now. I was like, Sweezy. I've been calling you Tweezy. I guess you you're a hot shot now. Thank you for letting me get some beauty sleep in. Problem. Ready, willing, and able. You and me, we got this. Discerning customer, would you be interested in some quote unquote food? 
Oh, you look like you're hungry for some food. Wink, wink. I can help. Wink, wink, wink. You sound familiar as well. Hey, welcome to Blordo's. I'm Blordo. You here for the food? Or the other stuff? Like pip. <laughs> what, what do you mean, other stuff? Nothing, nothing, nothing. Wait, Forget wait, I said wait, anything. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> no, come on. We're, we're good. T tell us. Oh, fine. I sell secret shit if you know what to ask for. But don't tell the cops. Now order something or leave. Kind of disc. Play for these two. Okay, tap both door. This contains the coordinates of it in the entire city. Which, which, which one do we buy again? Never Stop. mind then. Hey, uh, my name is Thomas Snitchdol. I'm s I apologize. I don't know how to fix the audio problem. Is this good? Stacy, are you downstairs yet? Yes. This is your bedroom? Okay. Yep. Okay, I'm not gonna take that level of disrespect for you. How'd it go? Did you get a jetpack? Kind of. That cheapskate mister keeps making us wait till he gets it in stock. Great. Perfect excuse for a rest. We're still waiting on Clug's intel anyway. Why don't you go to bed and sleep off some of that excitement? When he's right, he's right. Let's get a cat nap in. But... I don't want to kill... Exploding its mess. I'm good. Just hey, good night, partner. I'm just gonna sit right here and watch you fall asleep. I'm That's really weird. glad we met. You no, know, I, I think, I think we're doing something amazing here. How cool would it be if we actually stopped the G3? Sh sorry, shut sorry. Up. I'm, I, I, I'm just, I'm excited. I'll shut up. L let's get some sleep. Pretty soon, you know, we'll Thank be jetpacking across all the space. Sorry, I'm, I'm being too loud. You're probably trying to. Let's get you to sleep. <laughs> Okay, so I just slept through a bunch of days. What's Swip's day? Oh, achievement. Alright, partner. Let's take this jetpack for a spin. Can you make it over that gap? Okay. Holy shit, this rules! Okay, bye! Man, you're just no, like a TonyHawk.com jetpack bro. Go, go, I'm young. Go, you need to come back. Go! Go away! Sweetie's out, fuckers! Thanks for watching. You look ugly. Bye. Oh, wait. Whoops. Back to my roof. Sorry, I did uh, Maybe let's try that again. Nice! Well, I gotta tell you, Gene was right. That is gonna come in handy. It's also fun. You can fly while doing combat. It's a very cool uh, feature that we have here. We put a lot of time and effort into it. Let's head back and talk to Gene and see if there's any. Okay, one, one second. Apologies. Just gotta figure this out. Oh, everything seems fine. That was weird. I've been telling you to clean up! This place is a mess! I need you to clean it up before Tweet gets here! Oh, got a big date with your sad sack Flimborg boy toy? I Fuck off, Gene! Like you've even never been on a date! Hey, don't even start, sister. I know a lot about dates. I fucked more aliens than your brain could comprehend. And even I don't want to touch your boyfriend. 
so sick of hearing about this guy. Yeah, right. My boyfriend is so fucking hot, though, right? Wait, you haven't even met him. Why are you calling him gross? Yeah. You know I've got a whole life going on here. While you're off having fun, doing whatever it is you do. No, you're right. Her boyfriend's ugly. Just clean up after yourself, Jesus. Hey, look, I'm sorry if I'm coming off harsh. He's messing up the group dynamic. We've got a good thing going here. We do that fun sitcom banter back and forth while your nibbling here goes and blasts alien baddies in the face. It's great! Dude, you're lucky you even get to live here with us. I don't care about your damn dynamics. I'm just saying you barely know this guy. Are you sure you're even attracted to him? Most aliens only bang their own species. Oh, what about you? You just said you've slept with basically everything in the whole galaxy. Yeah, but I'm a washed-up degenerate. You've got your whole life ahead of you. That's more condescending than it is sweet. What? No, uh, look. Just we've like, spent all this time living together. I I care about you now, Leslie. Come on, not so fast. Can we hang around for, for, for a second? Uh, like I was saying. My name's Lizzie. Come on, tell her I care about her. Uh... We're all living under the same roof. And that makes us family. And it makes... Her business, my business. No, I'm the man of the house, so no, she needs to no, do what I say. And before anyone accuses me of being a misogynist, yeah, I know I'm a misogynist. Well, let's not bow so fast. Uh, like I was saying, we all know I'm a misogynist. That's bad, and I'm working. God, you're in a hurry. Not yet. This is about me being right and your sister being wrong. Listen to yourself. I can make my own decisions. I don't know why you think you're suddenly some father figure to me just because you're crashing on my couch and eating my diary. Oh, yeah, I said eating. He's been eating pages out of my diary. So what? My species eats paper. It's delicious. Who gives a shit? I'm so sick of this shit. Look, I just don't want Twig to think I'm messy, okay? It's that simple. And I don't want you dating him at all. Why don't I set you up with my nephew, Grimble Dick? He's got a steady job. And yes, before you ask, he's got both his legs. That's not like a family ailment or anything. Fuck off! Just grow up and get used to me and Twig! Come on, tell Jean I can date whoever I want. I mean, I don't... approve, but... sure. Thank you! Not that I needed your approval. Oh, fine, yeah. Team up against the depressed paraplegic. I didn't I know sure you were will. depressed. I mean, I knew you were depressing. Har, har, har. Just clean up, Jean, okay? Sorry to drag you into all that. Anyway, a nice little arrangement with Clug is paying off. They sent us intel on two new bounties. So, uh, go ahead if you want to get started on those. You know, I'm not really reading the descriptions, but I'm really feeling this guy. 2000. I'm really feeling this guy. Alright, here's the skinny. You're all gonna need some major firepower if you really plan to take on Garmantuous. What? More, more than we already have? Uh, our team is mostly guns. Trust me, we need this. Klug sent over the details on an extremely powerful Gatlian. Oh shit, another Gatlian! That's right. Supposedly he's in the possession of another G3 officer. A scientist named Dr. John Giblets. And guess what? I can't find shit on him. I don't even know where he is. Okay, so what do we do? We do it the old-fashioned way and ask around. Maybe we That's find out his coordinates and warp him in. I'm sending you to Blim to gather intel. I don't know. I'm fucking tired, kid. Maybe you'll appreciate me more if you do my job. Okay, Gene, all right. We'll, we'll, we'll try to find him ourselves. All right. Skip the portal door and just head out into Blim. Oh, and before you go, you might need a little extra help. I went ahead and unlocked a new feature on your bounty suit. You're welcome. Hey, 
Hey there, bounty hunter. Not it's me, it. Pseudo, again. I'm still here. I've been here the whole time. Welcome to detective mode. I'm here to help you sleuth out all those really big, crazy mysteries. Suddenly? With the fucking detective mode? Why, why haven't we had access to this the whole time? All right, let's see. It looks like you're looking for a... Doc. On giblets. Is that correct? Uh, yeah. Oh, fantastic. Let me do a quick search for you. This will solve it immediately, and... No matches found. Oh, well, it's never that easy. Why don't you start by interrogating the locals? Okay, I figured it out. This thing's fucking useless. Thanks, Gene. Let's get moving. Oh, that chick, that chick's way right. What the fuck does that mean? Hey, uh, did, did you know anything about Dr. Giblets? What are you talking about? Hey there, Misudo. Looks like you're trying to interrogate a suspect. Yeah, shut up. Let's ask them some questions. Uh, okay. We'll see how this goes. Oh, hey, honey. Do I look nervous? Uh, <laughs> oh, jeez, you're making me nervous I with this interrogation. What? Yeah, what do you care? Well, if you must know, I ate 15 whole sandwiches. And yes, I regret it. I don't know why I ate that many. Am I what? What is it with you and this Dr. Giblets guy? My name's Craig, and I'm really sick from eating a lot of sandwiches. Leave me alone. I'm really sorry. I don't know who that is. But <laughs> good luck. I guess. Hope you find them. Woof, they didn't know anything. That was a real D rank interrogation. Sorry. Yeah. Oh, wow. well, maybe you can just find more people to interrogate. You'll get it now. Hey, dude. How are things going? Bet you're looking for Globo, huh? You, you, I bet you want to hear him drum, don't you? You know it like a poet. Where'd he go? I'll try to wrap your head up this. He got signed to Blobbity Bloop's records. And he landed a big gig on a late night TV show uh, here, and this could be his big break. And it's all because of you. We all knew he was going to be a big star, and you took the time, and God damn it. Oh, we're just so excited. Thank we always knew it, too. That's why we gave him the drum. You know what? Fuck everybody who made fun of him for farting out of his face. Globo's going to be huge. I mean, this is a... You're, you're looking at the next... Uh, uh, Davey Wilson. I don't know who that is. Hey there, Slick. Think you can help us find a Dr. Giblet? Slick, what the fuck are you talking like that for? Oh, Jesus Christ, leave me alone. What, the, the drug guys? No, I don't have any fucking ties to the evil drug conglomerate. I'm a normal person trying hmm. to live a normal life in the city. Why in the fuck would I have Maybe any that's ties just what to you the G-Freak? What's my whole deal? Like, who am I? What do I do? Well, my name's Jackie T. Pooperton, and what I do is tell you to fuck off! Bro, I can shoot you right now. How you doing? Like, with your weird interrogation? Awful! Annoying! I wish you'd stop! Bye-bye. Ooh, bummer. They were a tough cookie. But they were telling the truth according to my sensors, so let's say that was a C-rank interrogation. Better luck next time. Let's look first. Finally, dipshit! I've been itching to get back in the game! Sorry. You look hungry. Hungry for some uh deals? Am I right? Hey, let us talk to you. Oh, uh, sure. Uh, what's this about? Can I ask? Look, the Fred guy. Uh, yeah. Everyone knows about the G3. <laughs> it's just we shouldn't be talking about him in broad daylight like this, you know? Shh. Hey, quiet. Don't say his name so loud. I can't help you, but Blordo can. Mention my name, See, Michael all we Pink. Was sweezy. Then he'll talk. But no cracks about my name. Holy shit, wow. You, we actually got something we can use. Okay, <laughs> that was an A-rank interrogation. Good for you. Let's head over to Blordo and mention... Michael Tank. me? Get me out! I'm still in a... Hi. I'm speaking on behalf of horny geriatrics everywhere. We're a little upset with the way that uh, Magistrate Paul Nugget is, is trying to deal with us. Uh, you think I'm starting to think you forgot about me, Bounty Hunter. Of course not. You're the very first. Get a knifey. Where are we heading? This guy? You there, how about some uh, food? Yeah, I've got... Hey, what's up?
What's up, Lordo? You know anything about a, a, a where we could find a guy named Jib, Dr. Giblets? Whoa, 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 where'd you hear that name? You can't just go asking around town for a guy like that. What? Why? What, what, what's wrong with asking about Dr. Giblets? I don't know. Why do you think I know anything about Dr. Giblets? I don't know nothing. Now buy something or beat it, buster. He's hiding something. No, no, no. This can't be happening to me. Ah, that piece of shit. I'm gonna kill him. Look, if you're really looking for trouble, maybe check out the new High on Life store in the slums. The Hyperbong 6 Midnight launches tonight, but you should be able to get in by now. Just don't mention my name. I didn't say nothing. Now get out of here. Uh, if anyone should... sees me talking to you, I'm dead. Thanks, Blordo. We, we had a good feeling you were a true pal. Whoa, great sleuthing, detective. That was an ass rank interrogation. Slums. S rank. But nothing about Sorry, but I, I gotta do with the, the right guy. Hey, there's my favorite VIP. I hey, you don't have to wait through any of this funny business. You are allowed right in, my friend. Yeah, you better head straight through. I don't want jerks like you hanging around. Shit, thank you. I like that guy. What's going on? That's right. Be careful. Get yourself killed. Okay. Have you have you ever eaten your own poop? Because you know. It. Stop talking. Okay, so we're okay, looking for this new high on life store. Oh yeah. The slums hey, hey, are a yeah. little more chill now that we took out nine. You don't want to talk to me. I'm the broken leg guy. Nobody wants to talk to the broken leg guy. I get it. Yeah, I get it. We heard you were asking around for giblets. Well, the Torgs are with the G3 now. Hey, fucking goddammit! Oh, God. It's the bounty hunter! Man, come on. I should have thought it was a Oh, shit. It's a lot tougher. Hey, hey, hey. It's working for it, I don't think it's working for Time, it's ready. It's not that bad. Uh, 
How's it going for you? Nice knowing you! You know we're on the right trail. And they said they were with the G3 now. Let's get moving and find high on life. Yep. Let's get nasty. And Skippy. I know this goes without saying, but we have a bunch of new abilities we didn't have last time we were in the slums, so I, I, I bet we can get around a lot faster now. Sorry. It's already got him. Sorry for saying. You know, look, the slums have always been a mess, but I, I don't like what they're doing over here to this place. It's, it just feels weird. Recharged. Is somebody fucking sniping at us? Plus you.
All right, that, that, that's got to be the high on life store. What? That? I'm a big Hyperbong fan. I love buying Hyperbongs. I've got 20 of them already. Hey, don't worry, I'm going to buy 20 more. Lines. The rules do not apply to the li well, well, well. I smell another mystery. I'm pseudo, by the way. You know me. Uh, yeah, we're, we're still tracking down giblets. Yeah, you already know what I'm gonna say. Try interrogating all the employees here. Yeah, no shit. That's what, that's what the fuck we're gonna do. Hello, and welcome to High on Life. How can High on Life help you today? Um. High on Life employees are not authorized to admit that we have ties to the criminal organization known as the G3, but can I offer you membership in our High on Life care program? Well, if you can't tie with the G3, then you're useless Woo, to me. These are some tough nuts to crack. Don't lose motivation. You're doing great, but you do get a D ranking because that one sucked. Shut up. It is my pleasure to welcome you to High on Life. Are you being helped already? All right, uh... You know, I can't recall whether or not I've heard that name before. Okay, then but I'm actually much more interested in telling you all about the fabulous features that okay, come yeah, packed shut up, in you with the brand new Hyperbong 6. Ooh, boy, they really want to make that commission, huh? Sorry, but I gotta give you another D rank. Oh, uh, uh, hello, hello, and welcome, welcome to High on Life. I'm Barrick, and I'm gonna be your personal uh, High on Life uh, pro professional today. Um, do, do, that makes sense, right? That, does that sound okay? I'm, I'm new here. I'm scared. Hey, hey, it's my first day. Uh, can you do me a favor and not mention Dr. Giblets around here? They told Why? us not to talk about it. God, I'd really love to help you because you look very cool. But no, sorry, I, I, I have no clue. He's hiding. Something. Wow, nice kid, but not helpful at all. You get a big fat D ranking. Could you like go away? Uh, like I'm busy trying to interrogate here. You just like getting all up in my face, saying I'm doing a bad job. Oh, wait, I already talked to this guy. Who didn't I talk to yet? Can't talk to him. Not even an employee. I haven't talked to you. Holy shit, this is a madhouse. Oh, 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 sorry. Hi, thanks for shopping at High on Life. I'm the manager here. Are, are you finding everything okay? Oh, man, this again. Look, man, I just work here. I don't know anything about the store or who built it. Or I'm, I'm kind of a fuck-up. I lied on my resume. I got this manager gig. I never even met Dr. Giblets. I, I don't know what he looks like. I couldn't even point him out in a crowd. But, but you know about him. Yeah, yeah, sure I do. He owns this place. He never comes How? around, though. I don't really know where he is. What? I told you. I have no idea where he is. And you're being really aggressive. Leave me alone. It's super fucking busy right now, and you're distracting the hell out of me. Okay, shit, not, not so good. Looks like we're gonna hit, it, hit a dead end. So let's get the fuck out of here. And... See? Nice day for a shopping trip, ain't it? It sure is. I know I'd go shopping on a day like this. Except this wannabe bounty hunter doesn't seem to be shopping. That's right. Seems like they're poking their beak where it don't belong. Be a shame if something happened to your beak as a result if you I catch our go. drift. More of this shit? Are you fucking kidding me? More? More of this? Why is everybody on our case today? Please, just fuck off! You got a fresh mouth on you, kid. Be a shame if something happened to that mouth as a result. Part of my associate here, yeah? he's only got one good set, but I assure you, he can back it up. That's right. A word to the wise. Stay out of this. Got it? We've got this covered. What the hell was that? Don't touch me! Wait, I'm stuck. Alright, no, no, we're, we're good, we're good. Holy shit! Looks like someone got trampled to death. Turned them into a fruit roller. Uh, yeah. My friend Davy Glutes got trampled in the rush. Pretty sad, right? Yeah. One moment he was there, next he's gone. Squashed. Okay. Uh, 
I want to toss out a shady idea here. We can use that dead guy's mag boots to climb out. He's gonna steal dead guy's boots. Yeah, that's fine. I'm glad you thought it was fine, because I was gonna take it either way. Totally take those mag boots. This probably isn't gonna so get us into the space heaven, but those are good mag boots, and we need. Hey, sick moves! You're making good use of those mag boots. You're using those things way better than David Glue's ever did. Look at you! Okay, so I'm pretty sure we can all agree we need more money. Who the fuck? Fucker. Is that... Is that it? We've got this! There's more of them! Oh shit. Trick hole. I would be using her a lot, but you're a pretty cool gal. Hey, my boy. How you doing? Hey, why do you want to shoot them so bad? Somebody got a problem with us? Come on, I feel like stabbing people. Oh, I guess we can't really end the video without finding Dr. Giblets. Such a weird ass name. Oh, 
know if I can say top. Hey, do your best and have fun. You think I forgot you sided with this dipshit instead of me? Nope, I didn't. Fuck off. I wonder what the dialogue would have been if we have one more blue. Bye, bye, bye. Go, go, go. Oh, shit. Go away. You called me ugly. Thanks for watching. You look ugly. Bye. Be crazy if I just fell down. Oh, not these damn shits. Well, you guys again. Don't worry, they're cool. We've been observing you. Hope that don't rustle your jimmies none. Because newsflash, buckos, we're on your side. We'd like to formally apologize for how we treated you earlier. We didn't realize who we were dealing with. You'll have to forgive us. And we're sorry we still sound like we're intimidating we're you. It's the only way we know um, how to talk. Our wives hate us. We represent Magistrate Clug Nugman. Maybe you've again? heard of him. He's certainly heard of you. Uh... Here's the skinny slim, the Torg family, or what's left of it anyway. They got Lizzie, mixed up with Lizzie, a bad yeah. crowd. The G3 cartel, or more specifically, Dr. John Giblet's PhD. And Clug wants it squashed, pronto. He says you're the right bounty hunter for the job. Says you're already helping him. Says the G3 is our common enemy. We've got a lead on Dr. Giblet's. He's been warping all over, leaving behind a nice little warp trail for us. We're thinking you can follow those breadcrumbs all the way to the gingerbread house. That way Clug don't have to get his cute little hands dirty. You dig? This kid's fast. Yeah, check out Dale Earnhardt Jr. over here. Let's say somebody dies. Maybe, hypothetically, their name is Dr. Giblets. Well, should anything like that happen, we had nothing to do with it. We didn't even mention it. This conversation never happened. And Clug will be very grateful. Speaking of which, why don't you follow us? Clug wants to speak in person. Huh, all right, let's, let's go talk to Clug. He just disappeared. So? You're gonna step through the portal door and go see Clug or what? Shut up. So, uh, what kind of stuff did you do in here? Like, anything gross? Y you have to tell me. Like, seriously, come on. We're best friends now. No. I mean, I hope I did. Oh, welcome back. Thank you so much for all your help. Yeah, they've been aces. Yeah, real pros. Hey, Clug. Sorry about those two. They can be a bit intense. Really, I don't know why they talk like that. But look, you've seriously done so much for me. I hate to ask for anything else, but this election is really close. Is and, well, keeping the G3 out of Blim, it's really going to help me lock this in. Do you think you could, you know, deal with... Dr. Giblets? Well, yeah, no, I mean, we, we that's what we want to do, you know, but it, it's just the trail went dead. A dead end? Oh, no, we can't have that. Let me just leave this map data right here on my desk. Not sure what might be on it. Oh, that's how we get to Dr. Giblets? Whoa, whoa, even if this map data did take you to Dr. Giblets, we're not 100% sure it would be his actual base. You'll still need to do some detective work. Fuck yeah. All right, then we just kick the door down, burst our way in there, find him, grab him by the neck. Hey, 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 I can't yes. officially tell you to do that. Not if I want to win this next election, at least. <laughs> Good luck out there, bounty hunter. Uh, we will do our best. Oh. Vamoose, you goose. Find us that fucking Dr. Giblets piece of shit. Make like a tree.
luck came through. He pointed us right to Dr. Giblets. Right? I kind of regret not voting for him. And Jill can come look after. At night, when the mask is off, I look at myself. Imagine. I may make the world think I'm happy, but I can't hide the truth for myself. Whatever happens, I must go on acting, acting, acting. Be a polyarchola. <laughs> Maybe my mom and dad would be with you. Feeling okay? If it's just a and Jill came tumbling after. Gary and Jill went up the hill to fetch a pail of water. Gary found out and broke his crown. And Jill came. You're doing great work. Thanks for helping our dad. We love our dad, Clug. They're my kids, yeah. Forgot to mention that. <laughs> Good boys, too. Yeah. That wasn't helpful. And Jill came tumbling after. Gary and Jill went up the hill to fetch a pail of water. Gary fell down and broke his crown. And Jill came tumbling after. Oh, you look like you're hungry for some food. Wink, wink. I can help. Wink, wink, wink. Welcome, valued customer. made in heaven. Well, you bought something I'm so impressed. You feeling that breeze? Cause I sure am. Oh, I love Hey, hey, my 
Okay. Well, I'm gonna gonna wipe now. Still wiping. Hey, Michael. Yeah. Whatever you're doing, it's working. Hey, and still came tumbling after. Carrying till he went up the hill to fetch a pail of water. Gary fell down and broke his crown. And Jill can come lay after. At night, when the mask is off, I look at myself. I may make the world think I'm happy, but I can't hide the truth of myself. Whatever happens, I must go on acting, acting, acting. Be a polyarchola. <laughs> okay, I'm fine. I just thought maybe my mom and dad would be with you. Yes, I have tried everybody now. Oh, I told her I'd be here before the end of this week. I'm so smart. I just need a couple seconds. Come one, come all, come marvel at the myth. Decided to take a look, have we? How fortuitous. Before you lies the mythical Zephyr Star Whale. Some say this mythical being pollinated the land with its mighty Star Whale Seed, which supposedly gave way to all life on Zephyr. That's the myth, but I know the truth. An old guy named Stephen did it. He just jizzed everywhere a few thousand years ago and sort of just uh, became a god for this planet. I guess. Oh, the progenitor of all Zephyr life. It's like, uh, I don't know what's supposed to get into that. It's fine. Their warp face budget must be astronomical! count. Ready for Sweezy?
No killing right now. Full of G3 assholes.
with that if I wasn't paying attention. in the head so you don't die of poison. I'm dying. Uh, oh, thank God. Thank God someone's here. I, I'm, I'm, I'm losing consciousness. Oh, oh. Holy shit, dude. You're fucked. What happened? A G3 base warped right through here. Right, 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 right where I was. And, uh, well, well it shot me uh, right in half. I got cut in half. Bet it was Dr. Giblet's base. Oh, God. Oh, God, I'm fading fast. Please, please, please just stay with me while I die. I, I, I... Rest in peace, fucko. Giblets, you sick fuck! Come on out! Where are you? Oh, I'm sure we'll be able to find Dr. Giblets with a little bit of detective work. Let's look around for clues. Fine, let's just get this shit over with. Oh, that's uh, a lot of dead bodies. What do you think happened in here? Whatever it was, it's not a good situation for everyone who died, but it's great for someone who was killing G3 mercs. You know what? That makes sense. Everyone hates the G3. I bet people try to kill them all the time. I mean, look at you. That's what you're doing. Looks like your typical work desk. Nothing too crazy. Uh, uh, you know, best I can guess is someone interrupted Dr. Giblets while he was doing experiment hmm, a destroyed drone. Looks like it was deployed for combat. Nothing fishy there. That's what they're used for. That's what drones are for. They're for combat. That's not weird to see a destroyed drone. Are we okay, yeah, I think I'm getting a sense of what happened here. Someone beat us to the punch. They attacked Dr. Giblets and all his men. Oh, we need more information. Let me hack the door so we can go deeper and look for more clues. He better be there. Howdy there, cowboys. Uh, oh, shit. Sorry, wrong bit, wrong bit. I mean, howdy there, detectives. Ooh, this looks like the lab where Dr. Giblets did his experiments. There's got to be something helpful in here. Let's get to scanning. Oh, really? Is that what we're supposed to be? old hyperbomb prototypes. Way jankier than the ones they're selling at the High on Life store. Well, you know... We just pointed these out, now we can move on to the next thing. Was he doing experiments on his own henchmen? Jesus Christ, that's fucked up, right? Yeah, it's fucked up. I know it's fucked up. I don't know why I asked. I knew it was fucked. Whew, look at all these drone heads. Dr. Giblets was an expert at creating cybernetic organisms. But we already knew that. You know, I don't think this is a very helpful clue. I do think it's neat, though. It's cool to look at fucked up drone heads. Thanks for showing me this. All right, here's my new theory. Dr. Giblets was even more twisted than we could ever imagine. He was torturing his own henchmen. He wasn't right in the head. Although I guess that's what Douglas did too, so maybe that's normal for the G3. Maybe he was normal. No way to know unless we go deeper. I'm hacking the next door! Oh. 
right, I got no fucking idea what this room is, but I'm sure there's more clues in here, so go go find more clues, baby. Are these second place trophies? They're trophies for, for what? Science? Just science in general? Do they really give out second place? Oh boy, did Dr. Giblets write this? He was really paranoid, huh? He really thought people were trying to kill him. And you know what? Uh, he, he was A Gatlin's in there. Oh no, they look like shit. Aha, so that's our murder weapon. Dr. Giblets must have used that modified Gatlian to attack his men. I have Pretty seen this powerful. One. Did a lot of uh, did a lot of damage. It'd be great if we could somehow get too. that Gatlian for ourselves. You think that's gonna happen? Uh, who knows? Let's find out. It says like an. Okay, I think we finally cracked this case. <laughs> Doctor <laughs> Giblets really did go insane. He was paranoid that someone was after him, so he killed his own men. While you were wasting time doing detective work, I was no, busy scanning easy. the area Wait. for Doctor Giblets and Sorry. decrypting the password on his security systems. Now you can just follow the waypoint right. So you wasted our fucking time, pseudo. Yep, sorry. I just love detective mode so much. I didn't want you to stop using it. Now go kill Dr. Giblets. Okay, uh, I guess Dr. Giblets went and killed himself for us. That was anticlimactic. Jesus Christ, that was the easiest one yet. All right, let me out. Dr. Giblets status report. No life sense detected. Entering full security line. Shit. If you're hearing this pre-recorded message, it means you've successfully managed to murder one of the greatest minds in all of super science. Congratulations, you killed me. But I knew this day would come and I was prepared for this moment. Now see if you can survive my retribution from beyond the grave. Okay, shit yes. We do get to fight. You want to step on the screen? Everyone called me crazy. Look at me now! I'm dead and you're trapped in here, fallen prey to my glorious science you were ever so jealous of! son, Crimothy. Yes. Yes, I was wrong. How could I have been so blind? I know who killed me now. It was you, Krubus. Did he know we were coming? Jake, yes! I kind of respect how many messages he had to record. <laughs> Actually, but I'm gonna kill you back. Enemy of the G3 sighting. This guy's pretty cool. How appropriate that for this that after up. all those years. <laughs> you finally got to get her. Just like you wanted. I really 
I'm proud of you, but you picked the wrong dirt. I'm bad with analogies. Blast that pesky Could sucker. This, could this actually be about the time that I slept with your wife? And then convinced her to divorce you and marry me instead? And then I made her do an experiment for me? And she got revenge against me for the rest of the days? Could it be that? I feel like it's probably not, but I just want to make sure. I know you can't tell me because I'm dead. But you can tell me. Tell me. My glove shot's ready! It's nice to kill something guilt-free, you know? Okay, I, th I think that's probably- Alright, if you're still alive, you can't beat Krubus. Krubus was too weak. I would've killed you. No, no, you must be someone else. Light. But who is it? Who killed me? Was it you, Douglas? Okay. You never told me your last name! Now he thinks it was Douglas? You call. Oh, uh, okay, pretty Douglas easy one. Real close. Wounded, unpredictable. Your relentless party habits always landed you in hot water with Garmantuous. Perhaps you wish to stop against the leader by killing his prize scientist. Hey! That would certainly hurt his feelings. But it was a mistake to think you could just walk out of here alive! Oh, wait, that's. It's just the body. I remember that party where you got naked and experiments with one of the scrambles. It was really hot. I took photographs. To get back those photographs. Well, too bad. I had rigged my computer to post them all over the internet the second my heart stopped beating. But don't worry, they're really hot. So everyone will think it's cool. Sweezy's gonna fuck you up! you. It could only have been you! How moronic of me to assume otherwise! You're the most obvious suspect. Nipulon! Nipulon? Sure. We haven't even fought him, right? Nipulon! You've been here from the start. Garmantuous's favorite right-hand man. You always hated the attention he gave me. You wanted them all for yourself. Imagine the evils you're capable of. I'm not even sure I can defeat you. But I have to try! Yes, Yeah. 
Yep. Time to fight this wave. Don't you be dead by now. Feel free to die. The dumbass finally got it. It makes sense, you know. I always hated myself. I knew I'd get the guts to do it one of these days. Good for me. Yeesh, way to kill the mood. So, okay, I killed myself. Whoops. My apologies to whoever's hearing this. I hope you'll forgive me for making you go through all of that. You can do it now. Have a good day. Giblets out. R.I.P. Giblets. Well, that was fun. We can get back out through the trap door. Let's scram. Gas can go away. As I continue to study these humans. I find them to be more complex than I ever could have expected. No problem! Initially, I saw great potential in both the Fergals and the Gaplings. But now, I Hello see again. how foolish I was. Those were nothing but dead ends. Humans, however... Humans... Figures the G3 would work with a creepy fuck like this. Oh, fuck! That's Let's Do It over there. He was pretty famous on Gatlet. Fuck, that's bad. Look at him just hanging there. I hate to say it, but he might be a goner. Let's take him to Gene and see if he can help. Oh, nah, he did. Sweezy's ready for blood. You there, bounty hunter? Garmantuous? Yeah, that's right. <laughs> I know who you are, and I want you to know how fucked you've made things for yourself. You were living in heaven before you meddled with the G3. Keep talking, shithead. <laughs> bounty hunter, I've got the two most important people in your life, and I'm going to kill them. <laughs> Things miserable for them. Yep. They're going to suffer as much as you've made me Fuck suffer. You. I'm not going to ask you to stop. I doubt you'd listen. I'd just like to inform you that I'm going to make sure you die. And that it's going to hurt <laughs> a lot. <laughs> Besides, you won't even be able to get to my new base on Earth without the proper coordinates. So just sit tight. Until I come to kill you, my and that was supposed to face us. I just wanted to say, you know, today really meant a lot to me, and um, uh, God, uh, this is so fucking hard. Um, your free trial of detective mode is up, so see you later, bye. Great, who cares? See ya.
Whoa, look at that. You found Dr. Giblets all by yourself. See? It's not so easy Sorry. figuring out where these bozos are. Let it go! Come on! Okay, uh, so we did find Dr. Giblets. Um, he is dead, but we also found another Gatlian. Oh, shit. That's great. I, 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 I don't know about that. I mean, he, he's, he's not really functional. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't think he's dead, but... Oh, God damn. Yeah, he's busted up real bad. What were they doing to him? Do you, do you think he's salvageable? Buddy, I'm not gonna promise you I can save him. That would be irresponsible of me. You would be careless to toy with your emotions like that. But yes, I can definitely fix it. Okay, th th thanks, Gene. Okay. But you know, if, if he can't be saved, it, it wouldn't be, uh... What was that? Uh, uh nothing. I, 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 I was being shitty. You didn't hear me. You, I don't want you to hear me being shitty. Yeah, okay. Weird thing to say, but whatever. Sorry to change the subject, but, uh... Well, I guess that's the end. Um, that, bye, bye, I guess. See you later. Like and subscribe.